Let's look at some skeletal muscle slides that we have here. The function of skeletal muscle is primarily voluntary movement, locomotion, things like facial expression, picking things up. You find it in all of your skeletal muscles which are attached to bones or occasionally attached to skin. Some of the characteristics that we're going to be looking for in this tissue are regular striations of dark bands and light bands that you will see in these cylindrical muscle cells. The nuclei will be on the exterior of the cells. Okay, here is a slide using the 4X objective showing some skeletal muscle going in several different directions. I believe this is a slide of tongue muscle. We can't see a lot here at 4X, but these are some of the areas that you would look for as that I'm pointing out for skeletal muscle tissue. Now here is the same slide using the 10X objective and we can see skeletal muscle in this region this region we've got some here and here and along in here this is obviously a very well fed individual we can see through all the adipose tissues scattered around we still don't see the bands all that efficiently but they're there now here is the same slide using the 40x objective and at this slide you can see some striations there are some going along here and there's some interspersed. I believe you can see some. There's a good spot of striations. And to get really good results here, you're going to use your fine focus to go up and down, and you will bring different areas of striation into focus at this point. Let's look at a second slide. Here is some more skeletal muscle. These are some very scattered fibers. Looks like we have some cross sections and some longitudinal cuts. A lot of adipose tissue scattered around. This would be called marbling in a steak. Here is the same slide using the 10x objective. Again, we can see a lot of fat tissue. There isn't a lot of detail on these cylindrical fibers yet. Here is the same slide using the 40x objective and I moved it up and down. I worked with it. I just couldn't quite bring out very good striations in this slide. But we can still see these longitudinal fibers. Here is a newer slide of skeletal muscle and we can see these little long fibers. Unfortunately it looks like during the process of making this slide some of these fibers got bent and I'll show you when we get a little higher magnification but this slide is using the 4X. Here is that same slide using the 10X objective. We're starting to see some little bands in here of some striations and we can see some darker little bends. These are actually bends or kinks in the fiber that were caused during the process of making these slides. Now this is that same slide using the 40x magnification. We can see the kinks in the fibers here, but you can really see these striations. And notice that these cells are long cylindrical objects that are lying next to each other. We notice that the nuclei are on the outside of the cell or the exterior of the cell. And these little dark and light patterns, these striations, are incredibly obvious in this slide. This is probably the best slide we've seen in this series.